Tyler, join here with Gary O'Connor. We spoke to you on the first day that you joined. How's it been since, since then? Yeah, it's been great. Um, you know, it's a great club. Um, we're doing all right in the league. Um, you know, everything's went positive so far for Birmingham. Um, I'm enjoying my time here. Uh, there's a lot of good players, um, and hopefully we can we can just keep playing well and you know keep performing well and, and getting better in the league. Hopefully, all the uh, all the lads and, and the staff here they've taken to you uh, taken to you well. Yeah, yeah, I think so. Um, you know, I think it's a a good group of lads. You know, everyone's coming together. Everyone's gelling together now. Um, you know, there's been a, a lot of new arrivals. Um, you know, now we're, tr we're beginning to see the benefit of them. Um, we've signed wonderful players, Capo, you know, there's a few good players we've signed. So, you know, I'm just happy to be here and, um, you know, hopefully doing well for the club and showing the fans what I can do. And hopefully it's positive what I'm doing. Just looking to get a few more few more games on the about now. I'm yeah, that's sure. that's right. That's the that's the main ambition. I just want to, you know, keep playing, you know, keep getting fitter, you know, keep doing the business on the park. Hopefully I can start scoring goals too. Um, you know, but I'm happy with my start to the season. Hopefully I can, I can go better. And you'd always try to hit high heights. And you know, the next game coming up, you have to be better than the last one, basically. You know, when you have played or when you have started, you know, you, you've you've scored goals, especially the one against Sunderland sticks in mind. Did you think that was the the match-winning goal when you come on and score that one? Yeah, definitely. It was good to to score on your home home debut. Um, and when I come on, you know, I thought I'd. Yeah, I thought it secured the win for us. Um, we're just a little bit unfortunate with, with Sunderland scoring in, in the last minute, basically. Um, you know, but we have to show a little bit of results and we can, we can be better than that and we can you know, be stronger. And as the season goes on, we can cut the goals out, basically. You've come back from, uh, from France, where you've been there with Scotland internationally. Great result for you. Was it a good experience for yourself? Yeah, it was a wonderful experience. Not many teams can go there, you know, runners up at the World Cup and you know, get a result. That's two times we've beat France. So, um, you know, we're not getting, you know, too high yet, so hopefully we can um, we can do one better and hopefully go and beat Ukraine and qualify for the, the group. That's the main ambition. Um, you know, we've just got to enjoy it. The fans can enjoy it at the moment, um, but it's just a job half done, basically, at the moment. It's a big confidence booster for you to get the results of the, with the national squad. Is that something that you can bring back to where and go and maybe rub off on, on some of the other players? Yeah, yeah obviously that, that's 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 right. Um, you know, there's a few players being away in the national team. You know, a few heads are down, a few few heads are up. Basically, you know, I've went away and won, won two games, got six points. Some of the other players have went away and you know got none points. So um, you know, you've got to come and you've got to be fully in the dressing room and have a bit of confidence and you know try and rub shoulders with the boys and you know. Get, get the mood up basically with the boys who's lost a few games um, but you've just got to forget about the games what you've lost in the games what you've won and you know you've got to focus on the game coming up against Bolton basically and you know you've got to be prepared for that one and you know for that fight and hopefully we can we can be the, be the winners at the end of the day in that one You mentioned the Bolton game uh, is it a case of it, it's a home match the three points is uh, you know necessary from, from the home games Yeah it's a massive game you know Bolton are down there in the mix um, you know, I think we're a point ahead of them basically. So, um, you know, it's a game we really have to go and win. You know, we have to express how we can play, like what we've done against Chelsea. You know, Sunderland, they kind of games. Try and forget about the Middlesbrough game. You know, we have to take something out of the Middlesbrough game as a, res a lesson, basically. Um, you know, but of course, I think we have to both have to come here. And you know, um, they maybe fancy ourselves, and you know, we have to play well to win the game, basically. And I'm sure we can play well and win the game at the same time. Okay, thank you very much for speaking to us and good luck for the season. No problem. Cheers, mate.